Alright everyone, welcome back. We're now at Leonardo da Vinci's home. So let's take a look around. Wow, that's a... hmm, what is it actually? A weird cart thing. Is there something useful here? No idea whether it really worked. Sadly, I don't have the time to find out. Okay. Jack. Hmm. Could be some kind of... Hoist? Oh, People I can actually say this. People about when I'm around. Especially not useful inventions. Yeah. What? Oil lamp. It could be useful. The box contains an oil lamp and a concave mirror. No, 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 let's take it, take it. The oil lamp and the concave mirror are fixed firmly in the box. I won't be able to get them out without breaking them. Ah. Uh. I can't reach. Hmm, let's see. An empty canvas. I understand that every great painting started out like that. I'll leave the canvas on the easel. Okay, paint. A Can bucket I take of red paint? paint. Oh yeah. Oh, I just know this ends in my threads covered in paint. Hmm. Painting. The Madonna Benoit. Back in the future, it's in the Hermitage in Saint Petersburg. I went there once with my dad. Of course, that was in the past of the present, not in a dream of the past. Hmm. Can I take what? it? Steal a famous painting by Leonardo da Vinci? Yeah. Hmm. It will be extremely valuable in my time, but I'm not sure this painting's strictly real. <laughs> oh, okay. That really is a lot of books. Max would be thrilled. Fascinating, but it would take forever to read them all. True. I am a bit of a magpie, but I'm not going to cram that in my pocket. Hmm. Oh, a flying machine. A master craftsman diploma belonging to Verrocchio, Leonardo da Vinci's teacher. I wonder if he was as smart as Leonardo was. After all, da Vinci must have learned some tricks somewhere. You see this flying machine? Stealing a master craftsman's <laughs> diploma isn't going to improve my skills as a mechanic. This is the first flying vehicle. I mean, if even if we can call it a vehicle, but first flying. Oh, there's an Fora. First flying the object. Fora contains scrolls written by Archimedes, which survived the burning of the Library of Alexandria. Max was after these writings for some reason before he was kidnapped. Maybe my strange dream will give me a way to find out where the writings are now and what they mean. Once empty, it's just a really old pot to put your flowers in. Da Vinci hid a clue to the whereabouts of its contents in a cylinder somewhere in this room. This room? Oh, scales. No idea what this construct is really for, but it looks like a huge set of scales. Just that. The right arm of the scales. Can I reach it? There's no weight on it, and it's not moving so much as an inch. There's probably a small catch inside this hole that keeps the scales locked in position. Hmm. There's a catch here, I'm sure. What's this? A tool. Let's grab it. I'll take this watchmajig with me. Yeah. It's a lighter. Oh my god, no. But let's try it anyway. A uh, headlamp. The concave mirror inside the box focuses and magnifies the light from the oil lamp. Hmm, nice. So what now? No idea what this construct is really for, but it looks like a huge set of scales. Yeah, it looks like. Jack. The hoist won't make the scales move one bit, as long as the catch inside that small hole isn't loosened. Hmm. What hole? We call... What about this? No. The poker doesn't fit the catch. 
Sword. The sword doesn't fit the catch hole. Hmm. Strange. No. Paint. No. Books. Hmm. What can I do? There is a catch Your for right this. I'm not scales. sure what. Hmm, okay. Let's try this. Nope. This. Let's see if this hydraulic jack can lift the vehicle. I hope so. Oh Product yeah. Tester Nina gives this hoist an A plus. Hmm. What's this? Chisels in varying sizes. I guess Da Vinci uses them for his stone masonry. Oh, I missed this. Yeah. So I'm. I, I suppose I should do this. Not sure. But yeah, I think. One of the chisels seems to fit the gap. If I can just. I think so, yeah. I've loosened the catch. There's a cylinder in that box up there. Fingers crossed it's the one Da Vinci secured his notes in. The clue to Archimedes' scroll. Let's see what's inside. That must be the cylinder I'm looking for. Yeah. Hmm, so what now? Oh. What? That's a code. Oh, I know. It's Leonardo's teacher. Master. Hmm. Rokio. C. No. Oh. Verrocchio. Yeah. These yeah. notes should tell me where I can find Archimedes' writings. Someone's at the door. Uno momento, I'm coming. Signore de Medici, how can I help you? Please, call me Lorenzo, my friend. I've come to pick up the painting. Is it finished? Ma see, si, a masterpiece. I will go and get it right away. Here it is. I hope it is to your liking. It is magnificent. You are a true master. I thank you. May I accompany you for a while, Signore de Medici? Lorenzo. Oh, scusi, si capisce, Lorenzo. Prego. Who would not value the company of such a great artist? Join me at my villa in Greggi for a glass of wine. So that's how the great master earned his bread. The Madonna Benoit was commissioned by Lorenzo de' Medici. My subconscious is full of useful facts. Right. Back to it. I found da Vinci's notes. Now I need to decipher them to find out where he hid Archimedes' scroll. Okay, we're back. Uh, I suppose I should paint something. Yeah. Let's color this and I paint. painted it red. And yeah. Now I can see the symbols much better. They appear to be a kind of code table in which every letter is assigned a cryptic symbol. And let's take this dark, yeah, dark page. Ooh, this is a tough one, even with the code on the canvas. Voila. But if I've done it properly, then the final entry says, Greek safely concealed in the painting of the Magnificent. I guess Greek means Archimedes, or rather his scroll, and it's hidden in a painting that shows or belongs to the Magnificent. The Magnificent, eh? 
Yeah. I'll leave the canvas on the easel. The canvas is now marked with the impressions from the walking stick. It appears to be a kind of code table in which every letter is assigned a cryptic symbol. Hmm. What now? Hmm. Books. Maybe there's something here. Fascinating, but it would take forever to read them all. No. True. I am a bit of a magpie, but I'm not going to cram that in my pocket. Book. Oh, there. It must be it. It's a little heavy, but I'll take it. Yeah. No. A chronicle of the Medici family with descriptions of all members. Cosimo the Elder, Piero the Gaudi, and others with weird titles. Well, I'm suppose it's not no. Hmm. Come on, Nina. Think of something. Let's see what we have. The Chronicle says Lorenzo de' Medici is called the Magnificent. So, Archimedes' writings must be under a painting that has something to do with Lorenzo de' Medici. Damn, it must be the Madonna Benoit, and it was just picked up. I have to follow those two and get my hands on that painting. My God, what a strange dream. Was Max right? Do my dreams mean something? If so, then I don't get it. Maybe I need to piece it all together. Over 2,000 years ago, Archimedes writes a scroll, the contents of which are so volatile that even the genius Leonardo da Vinci later fears to publish it. So he hides the scroll under the Madonna Benoit and sells it to a Florentine businessman, and the painting survives for centuries. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll be starting our descent into San Francisco shortly. Please turn off all electronic devices and fasten your seat belts. Thank you. The painting is the key. I have to talk to the restorer Max was going to meet at the Palace of Fine Arts. Perhaps he can help me make sense of it all. And find Max. As we expected, she's headed to the Palace of Fine Arts to talk to Anderson. Keep an eye on her. Excuse me, what happened here? There was a fire. The museum will be closed until further notice. I'm looking for the museum's restorer, Michael Anderson. Do you know him? Yes, I'm afraid he's been missing since the fire. Don't you have anything more specific? A lead? An address? Sorry, ma'am, but I can't comment on ongoing investigations. Of course. At least, tell me. The pictures from the Leonardo exhibit, were they destroyed? No. All the artworks are safe in a fireproof archive in the basement. So they're still in the building? That's what I said. Now, answer a few of my questions. Who are you? What are you doing here? What's your interest in the fire? No, I came especially to see the exhibit. I'm a big fan of Leonardo. Yeah, so's my wife. Did you see Titanic? Uh, yes. The painting in my dream. It's here, I don't believe it. Did all of that really happen? But then, behind this painting, must be the scroll, the fire at the museum. Is it coincidence? Or did someone want to destroy the painting? I have to go, have to, go to the museum and find it. No. Well, okay, we're in San Francisco. But that's all I have for you for now. Thanks for watching, guys.